My name is Jeff White, and I'm the research entomologist for Bedbug Central and the host of Bedbug TV, bedbugcentral.com. I have no idea how I got into bugs and bedbugs. And here I am six years later and having a lot of fun working with bedbugs. And I'll be talking to you about pest control. You might ask yourself, when are bedbugs going away again? We see stories on the news about bedbugs being virtually eradicated from the U.S. around the end of World War II. I know growing up as a kid, we never dealt with bedbugs. Bedbugs weren't even, you know, you didn't see them at anybody's house. It was just something your parents told you when they tucked you in at night. Sleep tight, don't let the bedbugs bite. It's not a real problem. Oh wait, yes it is. And bedbugs are on the comeback. You know, we had pesticides back at the end of World War II that we don't have available to us today. Residual pesticides. Pesticides you could apply in a house and they might remain active for several months, if not several years on end, and in a way, protect your house against bed bugs. And a lot of those pesticides have since been taken off the market for good reason. You know, they may have been very good for interior pest control, but people misapplied them in the environment and they had a lot of secondary effects on other organisms, whether it be birds of prey or whatever else might have come in contact with those pesticides. And so unfortunately, many experts are predicting that bed bugs are back. They're probably here to stay, at least for a good portion of time. We don't see any silver bullet on the horizon, nothing that's just going to eradicate bed bugs, you know, anytime soon. You know, we look at other insects. We haven't been able to get rid of cockroaches. You know, they're still around these days. We've been battling them for thousands of years. And so I think we got lucky with bed bugs back at the end of World War II, and I think there's a good chance that they are here to stay. We're going to have to deal with this. There's no silver bullet. And so what I can recommend is to get educated. Go out. Go to websites, bedbugcentral.com, other university-based websites. Find out what bed bugs look like. Find out how to avoid bringing them into your house. That way you don't have to deal with the problem and you don't have to worry about the silver bullet that's not out there right now. And so get educated, know how not to bring them in, and that is your best defense against a bed bug infestation.